Welcome to First Word Pharma's News Roundup for September 12th, brought to you today by editorial researcher Olivia Roger. In our top news story, Bristol-Myers Squibb's TYK2 inhibitor BMS986165 led to significant skin clearance in a phase 2 study in patients with moderate to severe plaque psoriasis. Results showed that up to 75% of patients given the drug achieved at least a 75% reduction in the psoriasis area and severity index at week 12, compared to 7% for placebo. Also in the news... Vital Therapies will end development of its ELAD system after the failure of a Phase three study for the treatment of severe acute alcoholic hepatitis. The company noted that it will now explore strategic options, sending shares down nearly as much as 90%. In other news, Novartis set a price of €320,000 for Kimraya in Germany, with one center in the country so far meeting qualifications to offer the CAR T-cell therapy. Pascal Tuchin, head of the drugmaker's cell and gene therapy business, said, We're working very actively with reimbursement authorities across Europe to set a fair price. In addition, Gilead Sciences entered a deal to develop treatments targeting the in vivo elimination of hepatitis B virus using Precision Biosciences' Arcus genome editing platform. Under the agreed terms, Gilead will pay Precision as much as $445 million in milestones, plus tiered royalties up to the mid-teens, for products commercialized under the collaboration. To read these and other stories in full, please visit firstwordpharma.com. Are you able to keep up with all the news and views in the biosimilars market? First Word's Biosimilar Index is the only dedicated biosimilar and non-comparable biologics intelligence tool available. Get ahead of your competition and learn more today.